two years after disappearance of body of Miriam Hamka. Lost Melbourne Woman. Discovery in bushy area brought back a destructive moment for another Victorian family. The body of Kobe Parfit, the daughter of Kathy Snowball, was found by a police from a mine shaft near Ballarat in December 2020 months after disappearing. This month, in December 2020, a 42-year-old mother and grandmother in living room police news death night he took a snowball. Kobe Parfit was attacked in a fatal way in Ballarat House. The overwhelming grief he felt withdrawn. Withdrawing his last hope that his daughter would return home. Hoping that the horror of the past months was just a bad dream. However, in his statement to the Victorian Supreme Court, the family was also relieved that he could bring Parfit home with respect he deserved. Snowball. Shannon Jeffrey and guilty of killing man after the hearing before the sentence came face to face. With his daughter's ur on Thursday. Jeffrey killed Parfit on April 28, 2020 and threw his body with the help of his friend Brendan Presage. 34-year-old Shannon Jeffrey was found guilty of killing. The details of Parfit's death conditions were not detailed in court. Prosecutor Jeremy McWilliam said that Parfit's family is not only traumatic to kill illegal killing, but also the brutal deception that goes beyond. Jeffrey and Prestige, who had previously been imprisoned for helping a criminal, staged the death of Parfit at the beginning to make suicide. They covered him with a towel and dirt he stayed until December. In May 2022, he tried to cover the Jeffrey trails further and took over Parfit's rent and said he had gone to Queensland. Ballarat even signed a legal statement at the police station and claimed that Parfit was out of the property. The court heard Parfit and Jeffrey before. At the beginning of 2020, Jeffrey accused Parfit of stealing selling his belongings and entering the police detaining him. Kobe Parfit's body was found in December 2020 near Ballarat. A mine mile Jeffrey was released on April 17, 2020, and over days he had concerns about Parfit's security. In a text message, Parfit said he warned that something was planned soon and behind Jeffrey. I can't sit while watching the cameras with the inside doors.